What's going on everybody? My name is Miran Cherokosian and welcome back to another tutorial with Pop and John. Today we are going to focus on the arm wave. Now before we get started, I want to let you know if you have not subscribed, please make sure to subscribe, hit that bell to get notified on all of the releases. Also, leave your comments in the comment box. Let us know what else you would like to learn on this channel. Now let's check out this arm wave and we'll get started. What's up everybody? Pop and John here. I want to thank Miron TV for having me. I'm going to be breaking down an arm wave for you guys. And as you can see, the logo is flipped around because this video is mirrored for you guys to follow along a lot easier. So I'm going to break this wave down um, into the most basic steps, the most basic positions. Um, I want you guys to know that the key to learning any of these moves is repetition. Um, it takes a lot of practice, time, and uh, once you get the muscle memory down, your body starts to just kick it into autopilot and you'll be able to knock these moves out whenever you want, all right? So, here we go. Um, we're gonna break these down into uh, all these different positions, all right? So we have position number one. I'm gonna bring my hand up. Two. Okay, position three is probably the most difficult position, all right? What we're going to do is we want our elbow to be up and our wrist drops and our hand gets pushed straight out, okay? So if this, if this position is difficult to find, um, think about picking up like a bucket of paint. Boom, I have this bucket, Ooh, I pick it up and my elbow's up, okay? And then I'm going to drop the paint, boom, all right? So that's your position. So if it's tough to get there, Think about that bucket of paint. I lift it up, I have my elbow sticking up, and then I'm gonna drop the paint and put my hand out straight, okay? So that's position three, it's right here, boom. All right, everybody find that again, boom. One more time, boom, yeah, all right? So one key about this position is I have my elbow up and I also kinda have my shoulder like shrugged down. I have it down, all right? I have my shoulder down like this and my elbow's up, all right? It's kind of an uncomfortable position. If it hurts, that means you're doing it right. Okay? So we have one, two, three, right here, okay? Okay, four is basically me lifting my shoulder up and straightening out my arm, okay? So it looks like this, uh, all right? We go one, two, three, four, okay? So I have my shoulder up. The transition through the shoulders is one shoulder down, the other up. Okay, so I'm going one, two, three, four. I'm gonna bring this shoulder down first, and then I'm gonna lift the other shoulder. Okay, because what you wanna do is have this effect rather than this, okay? So we're gonna go boom, 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 all right? That's the transition through the shoulders. We're gonna go up, down, up, down, all right? So basically you're isolating each shoulder. If that's tough to find, you want to lift, put your shoulders up, drop them, shoulders up, drop one, both up, drop the other. Okay, that's where you really start to understand the isolation through the shoulders. Okay, I'm bringing my shoulder up and then I'm dropping it. Okay, so I have hand up, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? Now we're gonna go basically all these same steps in reverse out, okay? So we have six, we're gonna drop this shoulder down to seven, which is gonna be our three on this side. We're gonna go like this, boom, all right? Remember that bucket of paint. Picking up the bucket of paint, drop it, all right? So the transition is from here, shoulder up, two, elbow sticking out, okay? 
That's seven. We're going to lift our wrist for eight. One. Okay? So it goes like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Okay? So basically, a full wave is you going through all of these positions and blending them together. Okay? So it takes a long time to get the, all these moves down to where you can blend them together and make it look like water, okay? So I really want you to burn all of these positions into your muscle memory and go through each one over and over and over, okay? So let's, let's knock these out, all right? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, okay? Let's go back through. Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Okay, back through. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 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 eight, one, two. So you really want to just really get all of those positions one at a time and isolate each of those positions. What I mean by isolate is if I'm moving my shoulder, I don't want anything else to be moving, just the shoulder. If I want to move my elbow, I only want my elbow to be moving, okay? If I only want to move my wrist, that's all I want to show moving. Okay, once you can get those more isolated, that's where your, your waves will be a lot cleaner. We have five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. All right, <clears throat> let's speed that up a little bit. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. You have to go over and over and over. All right. The the next step in this wave is gonna be blending all of these together. Okay. What I mean by blend is that you don't really see me stop in these each positions. Okay? Boom, boom, boom. I'm not really stopping. Okay, I want to like blend them. Okay, see how everything kind of like blends in together. Boom. All right, see that? One, two, three, four, five. 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 Okay, so that's where getting these um, positions really burned into your muscle memory, that's where it helps in order for you to start blending all of these, okay? So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Let's try this to some music, all right? 
We're gonna do one eight to this side, and then we're gonna do one eight back, all right? So this one is gonna be our one coming back, all right? So here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Good. Okay. Let's speed it up a little bit. We're going to go like this. Five. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, 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 six, seven, eight, one. Good, okay, again, the key to this is to repeat it over and over and over, all right? For me, on an off day, when I'm, when I'm really training some waving, I do 100 waves a day. I promise, it's not easy. It sounds just like a number, but doing 100 of these every day really gets your waves super liquid and very watery looking, okay? But I promise, the way that I started, was boom, 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 boom. Again, and again, and again, and again. Okay? Practice, guys. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial by Pop and John. If you're still having a hard time with the arm wave, just keep working on it. These steps take a lot of repetition and a lot of time to perfect. If you want to know more about Pop and John, I'm going to put all of his links in the description box. And if this is your first time on the channel, make sure to subscribe. Hit that bell to get notified on all of the releases. Also, put your comments in the comment box. Let us know what else you would like to learn on this channel. And I'll see you guys on the next one.